Well, water poses one of the greatest sustainability challenges of our 21st century. From industrial contamination to the lack of drinking water, KAG's HD News reporter So Young Kim joins us in the studio. So Young, the solution to this worldwide problem could be coming out of research right here at Texas A&M. That's exactly right, Matthew and Amanda. Researchers at a and say they, are, they think they're on to a new water purifying technology that may be the next big thing since chlorine. Water, clean enough to use and drink, something we take for granted in the United States, but a big problem in many other parts of the world. And many children are dying because they are using uh, impure water that contain pathogens. According to the United Nations, by 2025, two thirds of the world's population will have a severe shortage of clean water. Some place in China, uh, they have the water pollutant problem. Currently, chlorine is the most popular chemical used to treat water, but it's not a perfect science. Chlorine that produces uh, potentially carcinogenic uh, pollutants, chlorinated byproducts. Sharma and his team are looking to naturally occurring iron as an alternative to cleaning water. Some water samples that were polluted with uh, industrial type of chemicals and we tried to apply it ferrate 6 in order to uh, purify or to decrease the contamination. They hope this supercharged iron called ferret technology may hold the solution to the world's impending water crisis. Maybe we can make some kind of tea bags containing these things so we have a glass and just uh, put, put there so we can disinfect this water. A work in progress, but researchers are hopeful within a few years their ferret technology will be a pure success. Tonight at 10, what researchers say is their biggest challenge. Amanda?